welcome to The Millie Life. My name is Danielle. I am the owner of The Millie Life and The Millie Life YouTube channel. I am so excited that you are here. If you are new here, I post new motorcycle videos every Thursday and new exercise videos every Friday. So hit that subscribe button so you do not miss out. Today we're gonna jump right into it. We are talking about the ugly truth about the motorcycle community. Oh my God, so fucking pretty. I kind of sat on this particular motorcycle vlog for a while. I've been thinking about it, it's been on my mind. Um, and I'm just gonna talk free flow like what I normally do and here we go. Um, so as you guys know, I am a motorcyclist. I am a new motorcyclist. I've been riding motorcycles for two years, despite having my license for 11. <laughs> if you missed out on that story, you can uh, see how I got into motorcycles and finally get riding one. Um, I'll link that above. I own a 2019 Harley Davidson Fat Bob 114. And obviously I am a female rider. I am not a girl. I am a woman. I have <laughs> I have a three-year-old son. I am a mom. I own my own company. I own my own business. I'm a personal trainer by trade. I love encouraging and getting people to move their bodies in ways that they thought that, that they no longer could or were not even an option or supporting people who move their, their body quite frequently, um, my athletes out there and giving them the support and the tools they need to continue to do that at their at their absolute best. So you may think I'm a little bit bizarre of a combination or a weird combination, but here's the ugly truth, guys. I am a part of the motorcycle community. You may think it is all men with big beards and big beer bellies, chains, you may have your own idea about what that is. And of course, there's space for those people in this community, absolutely. But just like any community, it, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It is not isolated to a certain kind of people. The fact that it's a community is that we share something in common and that's motorcycles. I want to connect with motorcyclists, not just men, not just women, motorcyclists. And I was told one time that I drive a Harley Davidson and I drive a big, it's a big bike. So I should expect to be met with kind of, I don't even know what they were trying to imply that, that I should be met with a certain type of community because I drive a big bike and that I need to toughen up in order to be a part of this community. Well, I got news for you. I'm a fucking part of this community because I have a big bike. I'm a part of this community if I have a small bike. <laughs> it's a fucking motorcycle. My goal is to connect and I wanna connect with those type of motorcyclists and all the types of motorcyclists, honestly. I think it's fucking cool to ride, a, ride on two wheels. And when we wave to each other on the road, it, it's a peace sign down and it doesn't matter if I have a ponytail or if I'm a certain type of person, it's just the motorcycle is what connects us and that's really what I want to drive home. The motorcycle community is so fucking badass because it's people from all walks of life, women, men, moms, dads, grandfathers, grandmothers, tattooed people, pierced people, non-tattooed people, non-pierced people. Um, people that work the nine to five, entrepreneurs, I mean, um, adrenaline junkies, like the, people popping fucking wheelies. It's a fucking sick community. And let's talk about women for a second. Women are beautiful beings, period. I 
I don't deny that. I don't brag on that. I have feminine energy. I'm a female and I love that about us and myself. <laughs> but that is not the only piece of me. And when people make inappropriate comments about how I look or how any woman looks, that's objectifying. That's turning a woman into an object and taking away why the fuck I'm here. Yeah, I'm a pretty face. There's a lot of pretty faces out there. But I'm also here to spread a message, to build a community. And that has nothing to do with how I look. So here's the ugly truth about the motorcycle community. It is fucking badass. It is fucking full of such a diverse and unique combination of people. And it's not just for women. It's not just for men. It's not just for tattooed people. It's not just for people with piercings that, or with people that like to wear leather. It is for everybody. Doesn't matter if you ride a big bike, a small bike, a sport bike, a Harley, Indian, Yamaha, Honda. We're here for you. Hell yeah. And that's what I love about the motorcycle community. And if you resonate with that and want to surround yourself with people like that, with women like that, then this is the fucking community for you. I think if we can do that more as, uh, as human beings and connect on more simple things, like the love of motorcycles and not overcomplicate it with how that should look or why that should look a certain way. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I just killed a butterfly just right straight to my throat. <laughs> I think if we can connect with each other on more simple things and not overcomplicate it that you need to work look a certain way talk a certain way leave it in the comments below what do you think of the motorcycle community have you been welcomed in with open arms or you know have you had a different experience i would love 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 start to hear from you That's gonna be it today, guys. As always, my name is Danielle. This is the Millie Life. And until next time, I'll see you guys real soon.